What's up people, Manor here, coming to you with another video. This time we're going to be making an IKEA Alex uh, desk drawer. Uh, and here we go, this is how the package comes in. The color I'm using is white, there are other, uh, other colors also available. Uh, word of advice, this is pretty heavy, this is about 27 kgs or uh, 61 pounds. So when you're picking it up, make sure to uh, pick up your knees, not with your back. So here we go. And similar to the previous videos, I turned the box upside down, I saw the slip, I'm just going to put a knife through it and then I'm going to cut through it and this is going to be fairly easy. And once you have the leading edge open, just go ahead and pull this back slowly and it will start peeling off instantly. And there we go, this thing is out. And it's just paper. It's sitting in this box you're not planning to use. You can just go through it and it will just tear right up. And now let's see. Here's the magic happens. And voila! Wow! This is quite a bit. And I don't know whether these are going to be useful, but they are pretty solid pieces of paper. So let's open it up. First things first, the instruction manual. Uh, this thing seems to be pretty well made and the parts there doesn't seem to be too many parts in it it's just gonna be a lot of work a lot of screwing around if you know what i mean and according to ikea only thing that you need is a screwdriver and a hammer and of course you need to look like a total derp and have a question mark on your face and you should have a phone line that goes directly to ikea no, but joke aside, this is the total number of items that you need. These are all the screws and as you can see, there are quite a few of them. So uh, be ready. I think uh, on a difficulty scale, this project is not that difficult. On a time scale, I think that's going to take about an hour and a half to get this done. All right, rather surprised. Uh, unlike some of the previous times, uh, IKEA, damn impressive job, dude. They guy, these guys did install, uh, this thing came pre-installed, I'm not joking with you. This thing was already pre-installed in it, so this is going to save me quite a bit of time. So I might be getting done a lot faster. Impressive, the second also had uh, all the uh, sliding things pre-connected to it. So this is going to cut back on a lot of work. Alright, classic IKEA fashion, all the screws and everything else is here. So I need to cut this open, I need to get uh, the long screws and start screwing them in. Alright, step two after unboxing, uh, screwed three of the long peg screws uh, on the top uh, of the surface and arrows are pointing outwards. So this is clearly is going to be back end of the box. And now we're going to be keying in uh, these four pegs or the wooden pegs uh, on the back board of it. Alright, now this has been put and I did put uh, the back part of it. IKEA says that put four of them at the same time. I don't want to do that. I'll connect this one because this is a shorter side so it's not going to fall over. I'm going to put this one first. Once this one is secure, I'm going to put the top and then I'm going to connect it. Alright, the back plate is in place and this has been put up straight now. And now all I need to do is go through all these uh, entry holes and stuff and put in uh, these clamping uh, things. And this is the progress. So we are getting pretty close to getting uh, this whole uh, desk unit done and now I'm installing the bottom pegs uh, that with this can go on top and then the desk thing can be turned right side up all right now we need to just put these six screws in and uh, the bottom part is going to be done and finally all the screws are in now we'll just turn it upside down now only thing left to do is do all that so that's quite a bit of parts all right, this is how the semi-finished product is going to look now. And now I just need to screw in all these uh, screw bits into the bigger shell for drawer first. And continuing right along, I'm still continuing to build uh, the shelves. It's pretty easy, uh, almost done. The way to assemble the shelf is uh, put the bottom part down here, then put the uh, piece of wood that has the lip on top and make sure to it's actually going to have a hole put it right through then put the round square peg thing and screw it through then just drop the uh, wood cover thing which is this thing right here uh, between the grooves then take the wood thing with the lip 
facing inwards. I almost had it wrong, guys. Left facing inward, sync it up and glide it through the grooves like right here that I'm doing and make sure that it connects. Once it connects, just move this just slightly and it'll automatically snap right in. Once it does, we'll have to take these uh, plastic things and hammer them through this hole, which is right here. And that's how, what we are doing right now. Just taking it and It can do for the other side too. Now we're getting to the end. Now I just need to pull these uh, rails out and glide the shelf in and put a screw right through this hole into this thing, which is going to be this screw. All right, the last one is going in, and this thing is almost all finished. All right, and this is the final product. Everything is good, and this is all set. They did include these transparent things that you can put on top. I don't plan to put anything on top, so. I think this will be the end of it. All right, people, like, comment, subscribe. Leave any questions that you have in the comment below. I'll be happy to answer them. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye.